Hey guys, yeah, not a bad afternoon to spend out at TPC Louisiana. Sean Payton, of course, was teamed with Hall of Fame safety Ed Reed. They were facing Chris Berman and Saints kicker Will Lutz. Uh, they were, of course, playing some four ball, best ball, and also some alternate shot. Uh, not a bad way to spend the afternoon just 48 hours away from the NFL draft. But of course, there's a lot of work upcoming. And when it comes to the Saints, uh, we know that they don't have a first round pick when it comes to Thursday night in Nashville. But if you followed Sean Payton and Mickey Loomis, you know that this group is aggressive and you don't want to rule out the possibility of them getting in the mix. Now, Payton said the possibility of them getting in the top half of the first round seems unlikely, but he didn't rule out the possibility of them getting in the mix in the back end. It just depends on the player. Payton saying expect the unexpected. If you move forward, what realistically would take place? And you know, you're not going to move from 62 into 10, 15, or any of that. You know, you're interested in moving to 31, maybe. I, I, it would just be specific to a player. But I, I think, you know, the plan would be to go in and certainly, as we arrive for the first day of the draft, we're arriving knowing it's only one round. But nonetheless, you know, we're putting our suits on. Yeah, we saw last year they traded up to get Marcus Davenport at number 14. What will they do this year? All eyes are going to be on the NFL draft on Thursday night. If you're a Saints fan, just maybe after pick 15 or 16. Here at TPC Louisiana in Avondale, Andrew Doak, Eyewitness News. All right, Andrew, thank you. We've done